And now, on with the show. Hey, welcome to the motherfucking Rick Show. <laughs> I just noticed. I just fucking noticed that bullshit. Yeah, I just noticed that, uh... Oh, I get it. Shit. Bear with me one moment. All right, I think that'll take care of it. Yeah, it did. All right. Yeah, so I had a window open elsewhere of the stream because I was looking at some stuff I was doing, and I was wondering why I was getting such a weird, like, this dual sound going on. But thankfully, I had the, uh, the desktop sound off when the music started, so you guys probably didn't hear any of that shit. Huh. <laughs> yes, it's the motherfucking Rick Show. Welcome. We are doing Shadowrun Hong Kong today. Not the game, not the main campaign. Uh, if you're into this stuff, you've probably seen this already before. And uh, you may have seen the game before I even played it, for that matter. If you're into this kind of um, turn-based uh, kind of game. No, we are playing, and I played it before, I was kind of in a, in a funk last week, as I mentioned, and this will probably be the third day I'm mentioning it, and I think I played it and I streamed it, uh, which was odd. Uh, where are we here? So yeah, I'm playing, what we're playing here is the Cut the Cut Camp, pe Caper, Caper, Caper. Caper and wow, it's been like a full week, so I forgot what the fuck was happening here. Let's load it up. I sincerely I hope you're doing alright. I'm doing pretty good. So this game is uh, Shadowrun. If you've never played it before, Shadowrun has no voice acting. Except in the cinematics. And th those are kind of like in the beginning. and the end. And definitely in this thing, there will be no cinematics. So, Percy disconnects from the cargo ship, jacks into the sub, and you're on your way. The sounds of approaching choppers and hydrofoils gradually fades. Okay, and so forth and so on. Oh, we're inside of the sub. That's right. Uh, <laughs> I forgot how this went. Give me a second to get my brains together. Okay, so, 
Let me see. What happens is that the story so far, God, fucking Shadowrun, and these guys that created Shadowrun Hong Kong and essentially the character campaign and the whole thing, the best thing about Shadowrun is how in-depth. It's all about story and then just fast, bloody action. Hmm. Huh. So this is these are my guys. El Luce, which, who is, um, he's a street samurai. I hired his dumbass. Actually, this will be easier. Let's go here. Let's introduce the gang. I got Black Star. That's the character, the original character. I'm, I created him, and I'm playing. It's a troll, um, adept, pretty much. He's a essentially a magical kung fu fighter. Then we have a Duce, who's a street samurai, and he's got a little story. He got a vendetta against the corporation that I used to work for. Uh, my character used to work for, and uh, has lived in Hong Kong. He's from California, from uh, from Hong Kong, all the way to California Free State. And I think California is where I'm at. Um, my buddy, uh, my character's buddy, Rafik. He's another troll. Um, orc, I'm sorry. He's a shaman. Uh, we were both doing security, and then we got set up. And I forget how that went. I kind of, I'm really tempted to start it all over again. But, you know, no, not going to do that. And this is Percy. She is uh, a shadow runner that I came looking for to kind of help me get out of this mess that I'm in. And she's a rigor, and essentially she controls, cybernetically controls machines with her noodle her brain. So I, so the story, as far as it goes, the story, as far as it goes, is that my character, Black Star, goes searching for Percy because she needs to hire her as a rigor for a job they need to do. This is this is a run they need to make and. The first run to that run was picking her up. So getting her was a pain in the ass because she's freaking insane. She's like chaotic neutral. She just does she does incredibly unpredictable bullshit for the shits and giggles and usually lots of people get killed and uh it's actually it's kind of I, I don't I don't so far I don't like her. <laughs> so we're on the ship and I think uh Oh, I guess my objectives are right here. There should be objectives here. Percy must survive, inspect the engines. Under the tide. Percy disconnects from the cargo ship, jacks into the sub, and you're in your way. That means she jacked her mind into the sub so you can control it with her with her cybernetic implants. Uh, the sound of approaching choppers and hydrophones gradually fades as you make your escape deep beneath the waves. In all the excitement, you didn't have time to thoroughly inspect the interior and soon make an unpleasant discovery. And the discovery is, I believe, that something's wrong with the engines. Like that. Can I talk to her? No. So I believe that that's what it is. Where am I? Oh, that's right. He's an orc. She's a, she's a troll. Or maybe he's a troll. Oh, I don't know. Oh, that's right. So we're, God damn it. We're going to go and inspect. You take your whole team wherever you go. So we're going to go and inspect the engines. I don't know how she's controlling the ship and moving around too, but he is obviously doing that somehow. Doberman is our freaking our little machine. So that's how we climb up. Where does this go to? Where does this go to? Nowhere. Red stick. Yeah, Crest 6 is money. Why? Just money laying around. I will take it. I will take that shit. Oh. It's kind of dark in here. These look like this is like cooking area, eating area. Why are all the lights out? Somebody turn on the lights. Oh, that's right. The engines do kind of poop out. That's why there's no lights. Oh, Rafik, I had a question for you. Yeah. Most folks around here call this city Oakland, but I hear a bunch of say, Orkland, too. 
you have a brown hair. Which do you prefer? Um, I say Oakland. Though I don't mind when people say the other one. As long as they're orcs or friends. Oakland used to be a slur. Back when Sado and his kind started expelling all metahumans from the city. A lot of us lived here to begin with, and our numbers kept growing as orcs were kicked out of more and more places. Yeah, this is taking place in Northern California. They are in Orkland or Oakland. Uh, sorry, I had, I just, uh, that was me trying to get a kernel out of my freaking teeth. Because uh, it stuck, be it was stuck between my, my teeth and my, and my gums, you know, when you have popcorn. That's what happened. Ugh. That was uh, unpleasant. Mm. But we're proud of our home. Proud of who we are. So people around here embrace the name. They started calling Orkland. They started selling Orkland t-shirts, stickers, all sorts of ma merch. Those who had a problem with the name fled elsewhere. And now it's become a trending statement. Yeah, so there's a lot of... Um, there's a lot of that in this mainly in this part of the of not so much in other in other nat not nations not the what I'm looking for um in other countries yeah or nations I should put that we're states because Shadowrun takes place in different places it could be like New York uh, Los Angeles um, San Francisco Seattle um, Hong Kong of course uh, Boston there's a few people there's one in Boston there's uh there's just I mean all over the all over the US the world has changed it isn't it's sort of like the William Gibson's sort of dark dream of cyberpunk and um and somebody's you know <laughs> dark vision of D&D because <laughs> this fucking thing this game is bloody okay so there yeah he told her that's something I've been wondering about that sounds kind of cool I grew up in Central Valley and we orcs weren't too popular Sis and me got goblinized, and our ma seemed to think it was our our fault. <laughs> oh, goblinized, okay. Yeah, the goblinized. Goblinized, there was a, because there was like a, the thing about Shadowrun is that there was a major, there was a, uh, a global event which changed people from, some people were changed and some of them were just born later, but they were goblinized, they were changed, uh, from being humans to being orcs suddenly because it was it was like 2012 i think it was and um so a lot of a lot of shadow run stories can kind of run by behind that timeline and kind of feed on that a little bit and that it is kind of neat so essentially she was a child when the she was a child when it was 2012 and she was goblinized and who knows how long orcs live well of course you always live until you get shot Goblin eyes. How do humans react? Stares? Always oh, stares. Lots of people making comments. What they think are jokes. Never funny, of course. Yeah, I got honey teeth. Pointing out doesn't just make <laughs> pointing out doesn't make you hilarious. We had an easier we had it easier than most though. Those native California assholes, lots of them wouldn't Beat up on orcs and trolls out walking alone late at night. I've seen fire bombings, hate graffiti, all sorts of nasty stuff. Ah, oh, that's us. Yeah, a lot of social commentary. Well, actually, this is um, this is a hmm, a custom campaign, but a custom, um, an original campaign by. I should give you the name, but I'm forgetting now. You can find it on Steam. Look at the workshop if you're on this game. But yeah, there is there's lots of racism in the world of Shadowrun. Um Did it bother you? Glad to see you made it out of there. At least you escaped that place. Did it bother you? Sure. He shrugs expansively. I used to really it used to really used to really get inside of my head. Let me think I was worse than others because of my looks, because of my blood. I'm not scared of them anymore, but I still resent how much I have to think about such hateful shit heels. Glad you made it out of there. At least you escaped that place. Oh, I'm glad you made it out of there. I won't say that growing up in Oregon th out there is easy, but it did help to have a lot of my own kind around. Being an orc was different, but not wrong or shameful. Whenever an outsider would start trouble by roughing up our a little orc kid, a crew of us would show up and kick their ass. 
I would have, I could have used some of that back in Sacramento. I doubt I ever had an orchids out of my own. I doubt I ever have orchids out of my own. I doubt I'll ever have orchids of my own. But if I do, I want them to be unafraid of who they are. I thought that's what she was talking about. I wasn't sure. Just such a kind of took a line. Climb up. No, we need to go down to the engines. We're almost there. What's going on here? Inspect engines. Weird. Engines look like they've been in. <laughs> engines look like they're in great condition, but something's sheared right through the power couplings. Uh oh. We got gremlins. I think I spotted some bulk wiring back near the hatch. Let's grab it. Oh, they're gonna make me walk to get it. Aren't they? They are gonna make me just. Oh, let me just pull back. I should be able to move the. I don't know why I can't move the. Can I move the thing? Oh, yes, I can. There we go. Near the hatch. This is the hatch. This is where we came in. So near the hatch doesn't mean like this way? There's no way she could have spotted it this way. Near the hatch. Oh, let's go upstairs. I don't know what she's talking about. It's gotta be the hatch that we came in to the... What the fuck? This is unnerving. Okay, I swear that door was unlocked earlier. <laughs> you guys saw it too, right? I can't be going crazy. Oh, and the other side is on. Okay, okay, that's that is crazy. Uh, okay, so you know what's gonna happen here? I think I know what's gonna happen. One way to bypass locked doors in Shadowrun, in most Shadowrun games, because there are like three or four of them now. I lost track. Is to use your uh, your toy here. To get in. What can I do? This is very unnerving. Oh! Baleful spirit. <laughs> what is going on? Ooh, that, was, that was scary. You can't turn the camera. That's the unfortunate thing. And this is about as close as we're going to get. But you don't really want to get any closer. I don't think the the tunes, the characters look... Oh, actually, that's right. I, I can actually show you what they look like. This is what Percy looks like. So you see, we don't really need to get much closer. There's, there's, uh, but it does make it kind of a light game. This game you can play it on anything, literally. I'm surprised that the, oh, he's looking mighty dark. I didn't know he was this dark. Yeah, it's kind of awesome. Yeah, the shot, the the lighting is kind of weird. It's oh, he's got like shit protruding. Lots of Miss Percy again. Let me go back. And Duce, which I believe he's human, just looks like a regular dude with lots of. The scarring this is my girl. Your black star, come on, let's do it. There we go. Look at that. That's just fearsome. You run into this in a dark alley, you're like, "Fuck, I'm done for." All right, nothing's gonna save you guys. Okay, so we gotta talk to this beautiful spirit who seems to not want our sub to go anywhere. <laughs> oh, fuck you, Nate. <laughs> Look what he looks like. Oh, that's great. Beautiful spirit. You must go. You have to leave. You don't belong here. Die. You must die. I'll die. <laughs> oh, read this. Yes, right. She is, again, she's a magical sort of, sort of Death Star. They're sort of um, magic Kung Fu fighters. Uh, let's see. Read the spirit. Of, the spirit. So you have a bit of uh, magic within you. Read the aura. Your third eye slides open. You're immediately overwhelmed by the vivid brightness of the spirit's aura. It seems to pulse and crackle with haphazard energy. Haphazard energy, I like that. The dead blackness of the submarine remains dark, but you notice faint tendrils of life force strung through the hull, like rebar through concrete. The spirit does not seem particularly powerful, but is also much less stable than you'd expect it. Its fluctuating exertions seem to be wrecking a subtle havoc in the structure of the ship. Ah, well, he's all over the ship. What does he look like? He looks like monkey. He's like monkey man. He thought I slowly his back shut, plunging back into the darkness of the submarine. Uh, who the fuck are you? <laughs> I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Oh, that's awesome. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. 
<laughs> All right, let's go with who are you? Because I'm probably going to get that option to say it if I want to say it. This is for you, Elena. Elena, my love, I'm sorry. Oh, he's going to fight. Oh, we're fighting. It's funny. It's strange that I'm not getting the right me that I'm not getting any music at all in here. Um, and I think I know why this is. Give me a sec. I know I turned it down, but shit. Yeah, there's no music playing. There's only ambient sound. Oh, well, we'll have to deal with it. <laughs> Play your own music. <laughs> Freaking Kyle sent me a text, but I guess he maybe is at work. Man, I miss that guy. He's a good dude. Yeah, I, I may have to fix that somehow. But I don't know why it's not going into, like, the combat music. It should go into combat music. But, yeah, I didn't... Uh, I changed the music for this other one that I was doing. Anyways, let's just punch this guy. That's what, <laughs> uh, why, why fuck around? Well, actually, I don't know how powerful he is. What does he look like? Crit. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to have to tank him. Pretty much is what I'm thinking. Use one of my action points to do killing hands. I don't do I have any magic at all. That's right. I don't have any spells. So. Well, I, was, I don't want to throw knives. I don't need to. All right, let's punch him in the face. And I missed. I really should have waited. What is he doing? I think he's... Oh, that's right. He's more of um. Well, he is a samurai after all. Why is he like... Why is he like... Oh, he's got a basic machete. Does it show IP? Ignores weapons. Minus uh, something else. Does he have anything else he can activate for factory heals? The last one taking oh okay, fine, fine, fine. So I haven't really I kinda just used them to shoot last time I played them. Alright, if I miss, I miss. Let's go ahead and hit this guy up with a stab. It, what the hell happened there? Nothing happened there? That was another miss. Something weird's happening here and I don't like any of it. Let's put armor on her. Let's reduce her ability to get hit also. Which I sh yeah, just to make sure she doesn't get whacked. Uh, can he? Can he? She, I'm not going to have her move. Yeah, let's, 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 it's weird to not have this stat. Not have any music. So now I'm just going to use the Doberman. See if I can... Control mode. Oh, there we go. But now, I'm, yeah, I'm going to control him. Move him over here. So that way he has a, a shot. There we go. And also blocks him from... Well, it doesn't really block him from moving. He has one move, but I'm not going to... What can he do? Let's see. Basic self-repair, and he can shoot. Can you shoot this thing? God, it's like right, he's not, right next to him. You can't even see him. Okay, so we're not going to be able to hit this thing is what's going on here, right? Any shot. She's going to hit somebody else. Let's see. Oh, 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 where's he running? Where's he running to? Son of a bitch, really? Oh, he must have a range attack. Almost got killed. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Let's, uh. Jesus. He's just about dead. But one thing, one thing I realized is that he does take, uh. He does seem to take range damage, which is what he got from, from her. But he didn't, well, the robot didn't hit anyways. Let's choose the robot first, who still can't hit for shit. 
what I don't understand is how how is the robot like being a point blank and freaking out? Oh, I missed again. Ooh, robot. Uh, she's gonna move last. Let's have her. Oh, she hit. So I wonder. I thought she she would have uh, been able to slow the creature down. She missed that time. Holy fuck with his ghost, man. I, mean, I know it already. Let's go over here. Can I hit from here? That's okay. Go to shotgun. Nope, that's not happening. I don't understand, man. Like, this fucking ghost is the worst. <laughs> it is the worst. Let's see. Okay, let's take cover here real quick. He won't. I don't know if he's going to have. No, let's go. That's right. He still has an angle. What is this? Oh, crap. If I cast this, yeah, I'll have to. Can't move him, though. I got to move her and then cast him. Let me see. Because, yeah, he's in range, so that's fine. Let's, uh, let's move her to punch him. Yeah, punch him. Oh, yes. Oh, he's immune to being punched? What the fuck? What was he immune to? There was a, oh, holy crap. She hit him for a lot, though. And now, let's, uh, he's got one. Let's see if this, if this heal works, does what I wanted to do. Then, oh yeah, she got some HP back. Let's see if he can punch the shit out of this guy. Come on, don't die yet. There we go. I thought so. I will be back. I will be back in. Okay, back in. Cannot leave. Oh, Elena, forgive me. Okay. And he, he just boned out. What a dick. See, and now I'm gonna have to use. You know what? I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Inspect the engines doing that. Uh, let me see. Let's see what else. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna save right here. Go back out. I have to run this little program that should re replace the music back to where it was, and uh, and then. Come back in here because this music there should be some music in here there's not always music in shadowrun so i'm not saying that there's something there's nothing wrong with the game i think it's because i i use this thing that replaced the music for a different story a different campaign and i think uh yeah i think like for, look at the, you can hear the sound effects there's some weird like sound in the background uh what was i gonna do how's he gonna save it Is it on the side? That's the one side of here. And, um, oh, that's right. And I was thinking of, uh, I was thinking if I need, I was wondering if I need to heal her. Uh, one? Because you can use. Oh, that's right. You can just activate it. Click on activate. Use it on Black Star. Uh, and then it'll say you have to confirm it. You see, she gets some health back. Okay, I'll probably save it again then, because she's. Uh, I really don't like that she. I really don't like characters get they get they get hurt so badly in this game <laughs> that you immediately have to worry because you know once they're gone they're gone man ain't shit you can do about it. You gotta just restart from when you last saved. Is. Yeah, that's good. I will leave it at that. Okay, and uh, what was what was quick saying on this? Was it a five? Yeah, I saved. All right, so bear with me a moment. I believe, if I recall correctly, I got this under.
downloads and doing a search in my download folder. It's one of the best things about this game is the music and um I'm sort of uh I'm sort of pissed that it's not showing it. So bear with me here a minute. I mean I'll I'll fly back in a second. Okay, so now I'm gonna have to look this up. I do. Dark, go away. Go away. Freaking arc is starting to be so much like the same. Even the little, the little pop up uh, portrait size window. Let's go back. Yeah, it's California Free Change. There was, there was an additional program. I don't recommend downloading the Shadow on Music Replacer. Um, into the browser. Shadow Run. Okay, so let's look for that. But I, I tried using. There it is. Where did I fucking put that? Yeah, the Shadow Run Music Replacer, but I have no idea where I put that folder. I can only, I'm going to check real quick here, but I guess I can only assume that I put it inside of uh, Steam, but let me check. Sure. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. Okay, it's not, it's not here, it's in the other drive. These guys, what's funny is that the loading time, the only thing that putting in an SSD drive helps you with is loading times. Of course. Yeah, load in this kind of game because everything loads and you're done. So what, you save yourself 15 seconds by, by using... Uh, um, where is it? There it is. Yeah, by putting in on an SSD. But I think, I guess I did. I didn't realize that. I thought I had not, but where is the fuck? You man, there. Common. Shadow on Hong Kong, there it is. Dump box. No, I don't. Fuck me, man. I don't know what I did with this thing. Teamwork shared. Oh, you know what? Who cares? Let me, uh. I, I found it anyway, so let me go back to that. Here it is. Extract to. Can you give me that option? Here it is. Well, let's search again. Search again. No, it's not search. Go on here. Ah, 
Ah, okay, click on restore. Okay, so I have to browse. Find after, okay, replace change browser. Browse to, okay, installation. Where's it at? That's right, yeah, I already found it. Oh, okay, I gotta secure the. And restore. Restore successful. Original hard drive is now play for all cameras. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, sorry for the delay there. It was annoying me. I was annoying. There we go. Yeah, that did not take as long as I thought it would. Got a Yeti jug a while back. You know, I heard about it. I thought, oh, this thing can keep stuff hot for a long time and cool for a long time. Oh, is nobody gonna talk about what just happened? So you just ended and we're like, uh, what? Uh, no, nobody's gonna talk about it. No conversation. I can't engage in conversation on my own with them unless we're kind of relaxing and not doing. Like, not in a campaign, apparently. Move over here. Right, let's get in close. I mean, this is only fun if you get in close. So we're back to the engine. This is... Oh, that's right. How do we get through there, then? Let me see if I can find something down here. Oh! Wh what? What? <laughs> Oh my god, what is what the hell is this? Oh, a spirit. Hello, sir. How do you do? You look you look a little uncomfortable. Ooh, how are you? Uh I'm Black Star. I'm a friend. I'm getting really tired of this shit. <laughs> oh, like that response. I do wanna pick some of the more like I don't give a fuck responses, so I'm gonna go with I'm getting really tired of this shit. Spirit, you saw the captain. Our leader will destroy. Our leader is Stren. Oh my god, what is this? You will sit, will tear the ship apart. It will not help. We will remain here until the end. He's got four responses. <laughs> you know what? Another thing that I noticed this is this is, this is a custom campaign, so. Somebody created this, but I did notice that in this, in situations where I usually encounter the character for the first time, you'll get three responses. One of them will be pretty funny, like, I'm getting really tired of this shit, but at least you're the same dialogue tree. So I'm saying I'm getting tired of this shit doesn't do anything. It doesn't affect anything. It's not a skill check. Who are you? What happened here? How can I restart the power? I need to leave. <laughs> I think that's how you end the conversation. Who are you? Constipated. That's all I remember. A flash of every burst of emotions calling me. So violent. So hungry. I am. I was. I am. Can you help? Uh, can you teach me who I was back when I was me? Perhaps uh, then I will be able to leave. I mean, hook up a brother, right? <laughs> That's kind of funny that you're like, who are you? And all of a sudden he's like, uh, hey, hold on a second. You could help me. What happened here? All existence, birth, growth, death. I'm not going to do the voice the whole thing. But it was all wrong. The wrong order. It wasn't supposed to happen like this. So more than likely what's happening here, I'm going to take a wild guess. Spell went wrong or some sort of experiment went wrong. 
Shadowrun is just is the mixture of magic and technology, so shit goes wrong all the time. In spectacular ways. Confused, I heard it, I saw it, I tasted it, I smelled it, but I didn't understand it. And now, I cannot remember. I gotta restart the power. He's really, even the questions I asked, he doesn't directly, let's hope he directly answers this one. Someone's searching, yeah, okay, he's not. I can feel them now. Those who hunt you. Those who have reclaimed the ship. All those bright, eager, hungry, jealous souls. Casting their thoughts down on the water. Sending their hate there. We three. We miserable trio. We are the sub. The sub is us. We may tear it apart. We may release it. The chip ghost. Must find the record written the silicon. Of course. The soul of cyber. The memory in metal. Find the answers. Explain to us. Then we may know. Then we may leave. So they have no idea why they're haunting. Typical ghost bullshit. Uh, maybe she's talking about the terminal? Like electronic records or something? That's my only guess. We should check it out. The thing is that we get into the sub because of her dumbassness. And I think we stole the sub. That's why we didn't know this shit was going on. But I thought it was her sub. I, I, I don't know. I'm confused now. I tell you what, I wouldn't mind having a sub. It'd have a lot of windows though if I had a sub. Okay, so we gotta find uh, find answers in the ship's terminal. All right, here we go. I think the terminal is up here. Oh, and of course, there's like devil rats. God, of course, we gotta fight shit. Why the hell not? Well, go for it. Oh, they get for oh, they got initiative. Oh, they got initiative. Oh, they don't even hit that hard. Yeah, they got initiative. What the fuck? Let's uh, move a little bit here. And I don't like how it puts me in the center of the screen. That I need to be more towards more towards the bottom. Since I'm gonna be playing down here a lot anyways, I don't need to. My head doesn't need to move that much. And also, I want to be able to see the rest of my team. So it's kind of weird. I don't like that I can't move the map with a mouse. I wish I could. Uh, is there a way? Oh, yeah, you can. That's, that's shit. I forgot you could. It is right. Well, I don't even know if it's worth fucking around for her to do this, but I bet you these rats are not even that. Uh, I should have spelled her up first, too, because again, she's getting hurt. Come over here, mage. Now move him. It doesn't really matter. Where I move him, to be honest. He needs to get his machete out and help me out. Let me chop down these, these little fuckers. Yeah, let's go ahead and take a let's take a hit. Yeah, he's he's some sort of samurai <laughs> with a machete. Oh, there's a dead rat. It's funny that I'm fighting devil rats. It is sort of hilarious. Yeah, it'll take two for her to move. She could probably get here, use her shotgun. No. If she uses her shotgun, she's gonna shoot everyone. I need her to move. Yep. And now I need her to use her shotgun. And okay, and she's done, right? So is this rat? There you go. Oh, and you know what? I just fucking noticed. So got that music. I can't see him. Oh my god, sight. Motherfucker. Why is he there? Uh gotta move there and then he's gotta take a shot right here and miss at 99 how do you miss at 99 i don't get that who's gonna jack in 
Man, we don't have a Decker. Oh, CC is a Sif Sisyphus. Property of, uh, is it Shawi? Sh I always have such a hard time with this freaking name. Uh, Shawasi. That's what it is. Shawasi Envirotech. A division of Shawasi CF CFS. OS version 23.1.14. Six cards removed. The second queries. What is the current ship status? What happened here? Who served on the boatless vessel? Search for specific term. Access Chinese data store. Let's, let's do that. Let's do that one first. To the bottom one first. File system is mounted on a write only mode. Access granted only to authorized Shawanese matrix personnel. Decking. I can't check in because I don't have a freaking decker. Wow. Okay. Um, search for specific item. Specific item. What was it? What was he saying? What was he saying? Because there was a lot of gibberish that that guy was saying, but some of it might have been like a clue something I go search for. Well, let's go back. Let's cancel here and just start from the top. I'm almost out of water. Um, what I was saying about the Yeti, it's fucking awesome. That's it. That's all I wanted to say. Torpedoes available. Eight electronic security disables uh, recordings offline. Press any key to continue. Communications offline. Engines offline. Power reserves. 86. Power active. 1%. What happened here? Search parameters too broad. Please, rest please restate your query. Who served on this vessel? Fetching the most recent manifest. Please wait. Captain Peter Yosef. That's what I was talking about. First officer, first officer redacted. Engineer Elena Pross. Redacted. Redacted. Uh, manifest? No. What was he saying? Oh. Hmm. What was he? God damn it! I see. I can't recall what he was talking about. Let me see. If I can get a little hint over here. Yossa. Name Peter Yossa. Title Captain. Date of birth. 2025, 820, hometown, daily city. One, what did he add? Probably more info. But that, so that was him. Let's see if that's, let's go ahead and see if that's enough. Because he wanted to know who he was. Let's see if we can tell him. Hey, dude, you were like totally the captain. Why well, have you returned? Do you have any knowledge for me? This Peter Yosef. The captain, my captain, our captain, our leader, our savior, our destroyer. So quiet, so careful, so generous, always watching, planning, preparing to provide. And then, but no, I can't think of that. I must not. And that's why I have amnesia. The spirit of his face flings out an ethereal arm, pointing away from the room. There, find that. Seek answers. I feel fear. I do not want to live again. I have to live again, or I will never. Averts his face and flings out an ethereal arm, pointing away from the room. There, find that. There's so much he said, but I'm missing something. All right, here we go. We'll continue our exploration. Oh, shit. More demon rats? I'm tired of you guys. So I, what I did over here is I, I clicked on here to trigger the... Uh, to, to trigger combat. So the reason I did that is because I want this guy, and hopefully you can see me, to spell her up first. She's been getting 
her ass kicked lately. Come on. And I'm not down with that. And I'm not even gonna use like the mighty the mighty punch that each she can use. It's gotta well maybe I should. There's too many guys in here. It's kinda hard to see what they look like, but they do they have four tails? The fuck they have like tentacles for tails? Alright. Yeah, let's go to buffer up too. That extra damage is useful. And let's see what he can do. He could have actually come over, dropped a grenade, and then moved on, but not moved on, but you know, you know. And then it was as a softening, but we need to use the other thing to soften. This one hits for less, but these guys are so. It does, all, yeah, it does uh, AP damage. Here's the difficult part. How do I get her over there? You know what? Let's not even worry about that. This. Where's the robot? There we go. Control. And then I can move her later. He's not going to be able to go far. He's only going to be able to go about right here. Let him take a shot. Oh, he still hit. Nice. And then I'm just going to have her... I'm going to have to do here. Yeah, I'm just going to have her move over here. There it turns. Oh! She didn't... Oh! Get some sort of bile or something. What's what? Why are they running away? What are they doing? What? Oh, they might be just trying to gather some room so they can... So they can, uh... Get some space. So they can fire like a like a, a range of attack. He needs to get over here and blast these guys. Come on. Too bad I can't see what I'm doing. It's so dark in there. No, let's just let's just shoot this guy. Oh, that was nice. He's done. I don't want to give him all the. Let's have the shaman move. He needs to move. No, 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 not yet. She needs to move. Oh no, that's right. She doesn't need to move. She needs to shoot this thing right here. Nice. Okay, that's what I wanted. Come on, robot. Let's plug this guy full of holes. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Hit him for seven. Seven. Is she fast enough to go all the way up here? Down here? Oh, what? Yeah, let's just kill these guys out. We already split the, the party, so why fuck around? Oh, nice. Then he he should be able to take this guy out, I think. Put a few bullets in him. Oh, oh, that's not the end. Oh, it's running away. They may not have AP enough to attack after the attack that he put on him and the attacks that they've done so far. They just may not have the AP to attack. But now that I can see him better, they are pretty hideous. She can kill them both, so let's just have her do that. No, she can't kill them both. What? That's weird. Nope. Is that they're not? She's not in range. Okay. But we're good. Is there anywhere else to go down here? So I killed the rats, and now there's like nothing. Oh, no reason to be up here. There are gonna be more rats when I go up there. Oh, God damn. It's get, is it getting worse or something? What's happening here?
It's like ley lines right here. We know like bodies and it wasn't tore up like this before. It's literally like a communicator. Mission added message to Sophie. Oh, let's read this. Let's find out what's going on here. Message to Sophie Dirks. This communication is offline, but still shows the most recent message on its lock screen. Attention, Sophie Dirks. I have a plan. Meet me in the army at 1500 hours. Captain Yosef. You know what he wants. He just wants to bang. Like a, that's like the keyword uh, for a booty call. That's what I'm thinking. I mean, that's all I can come up with. Search for a specific term. Let's do armory. No data for armory. Uh, what's her, what was her name? Dirks? Green, yes. Name, Sophie Dirks. Title, first mate. Date of birth, 2033. Hometown Hayward. Hayward. Good old Hayward. No, Hayward is a suburb of uh, the Bay Area. Uh, additional records available for viewing, uploading, log entries to main memory. Done. View logs. Please select an entry. Holy shit, nice. Captain's log. Picked up a new skeleton crew today. Uh, Shawa. <laughs> Shawasi spreading it is Shawasi, right? Shawasi spreading is thinner than ever before, but at least they don't skimp on electronics. The sissy fuss practically runs itself. You just need to push the right buttons at the right time and stay out of each other's way. First mate, we're dead in the water. Well, dead under the water. No engines, no communication. Trapped down here. We can recycle oxygen indefinitely, in indefinitely, but the food. The delicious food. The rats appeared. Where could they have come from? We're underwater for months without a sign. Now the sub is damaged. There's something all over the place and their foot constantly multiplying. I'm going to talk to the captain about it again. No matter what precautions we take, the rats always find our food, always eat it. We're out of everything. Not a crumb left anywhere. Maybe he has something stashed away. Some emergency store that will help us survive for just a few more days. Maybe help us. Maybe help will finally come. This reminds me of um, that movie where Bill Murray's like the main, this whole thing that you're saying. Bill Murray's, Bill Murray's the mayor of this uh, this underground town. I think it was called uh, something of Ember. I Town of Ember or what it was called. It's kind of like a young adult thing. But I do remember like he's hoarding all the food. <laughs> he's hoarding all the foods. He's got like food for days and his... Uh, little area and then uh, of course they end up going to the surface and it's so wonderful and everybody's happy okay emperor engineer's log who's the engineer elena Prots. i'm gonna wait, see is that guy almost have to make um notes here let me at least where's my notepad the fuck is it? let me at least write the name what's it Pros. Elena. Elena. Oh, that's right. The guy's saying my Elena. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, Elena Pros. Captain Yoss is a genius. Sophie and I were panicking, convinced that the rats would be our destruction. When they were our salvation all along, neither of us have been able to catch any of them, but Peter set up a trap or something and killed enough to make a feast. They're eating rats like crazy. We dined for over an hour on delicious kebabs, drank all that was left of the wine, he put his hand on my knee. I didn't complain. That's right, baby. I wish that Sophie could have joined us. Peter had her, I'm sorry, Peter has has had her working on the torpedo room ever since yesterday. I haven't even used her, I haven't even seen her today. He has some kind of plan to get us out of here. Now that the strength is, now that our strength has been gained from devouring the rats, we'll be able to make our move. I just hope that he lets me relieve. Oh, I'm sorry. He lets me relieve. Uh, he, he lets me relieve her soon, so she can eat as well. She must be starving by now. See, they're rats. They're not normal rats. And then it's on to me. After last night, I'd hoped that she 
would be content by my side, but she snuck into the torpedo room while I was asleep. Of course, she didn't find her sister. Ah, uh, that's Peter. Peter, yeah. Uh, okay. He ate her. <laughs> she hasn't pierced anything together yet, but she will. Maybe she already has and isn't prepared to accept it. We're going to die. I rush towards our death. Why should three suffer together? Why not try and enjoy the time we have left and those in our carnal desires? The lure of all flesh. He ate her. You know he ate her. Like doesn't you know, like it's a it's a it's a red herring. You're thinking oh, you know they fucked. But why would he be like he's on to you and you see a sister there, like you know he ate her. We two could live here happily for a month, longer if we stretch our bounty, if we cooperate, if we agree to each to each sacrifice what we need. When we need it, we could diminish gracefully, becoming less of our lives less as our lives extend, leaving our bodies behind as we inch towards the afterlife. Wow, that is just that is just weird and macabre, man. That is just that I'm I'm not down with that. <laughs> I am not down with that. Engineers log. Elena Pros. No I didn't know, but I should have we were sisters. I should have felt something. Should have sensed it, or at least I should have refused to take the first bite until I saw her safe again. Oh, the rats! Oh, my rats! Holy shit! He has gone mad, or perhaps he's always mad. Perhaps this disaster just gave him the excuse to indulge a sick craving. Maybe he caused the disaster in the first place. I never learned what caused the explosion or where the rats came from. Rat noise. His proposal was untenable. I ran, had locked myself in the room, this room and prayed for eternal damnation upon his soul to any god who would listen to any spirit to any being that will give anything my life my mind my all i cannot change my past so we'll make his future the same hell that mine has become yeah revenge buddies revenge a month of starving to death is too light a punishment my vengeance must be eternal and you just log and then a pause. Something answered. So much blood. Such screams. I don't regret it, but I'm afraid. I promised them everything. This vessel is theirs. My body is theirs to their own private hell on earth. And with each passing moment, the slick oiliness of their evil seeps deep into my soul. My body is still out there. What's left of it? So hungry. He showed me the way. I could keep on living, just a taste. It does not matter. Not when he's dead. It's final gift. These guys just ate each other. God, God, what has he done to me? What have I become? I made a ship report. Gunshot detected. No significant hull damage. Returning to surface. No signs remaining on board. Riveting security ceiling. Oh, what was it? Reverting security ceiling. Se se <coughs> settings. <coughs> I get my settings. I can still hear seagulls in the uh, the game soundtrack. Yeah, I can still hear seagulls. You know what? Got something. So yeah, this is uh, all very gruesome. Okay. And uh, I don't, I don't approve at all. I disapprove actually. What do you think of that? There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about this. I was checking how long I've been on. I need to I need to tell Nightbot how to do that. I need to teach Nightbot how to do that. Not that anybody gives a shit at this point. Least of all me, but I'm the only one that's checking just because I need to get up and take a break and shake it off kind of thing. Uh go back. I said the queries. Search for a specific term. Oh, we don't shit out of the way. 
Move off. Went back. I already read them all. Maybe there's nothing more to read here. We know exactly what happened. Right, so there's no nothing more to search for or look for. The ship's not gonna tell me anymore. Think more than I need to know. I think I seem to know everything I need to know. Mm, there was oh, it went to red alert. Confer Elena, financier of the ship terminal. Where's Elena at? Or oh, Elena's the other ghost that's running around. I think. Unless she's like the the uh yeah, unless she's like, what's over here? I don't like this. This is very, I don't want to get on that. I'd like to bypass it if I could. Oh! Oh, no, 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 I don't approve of this. She's like, fuck this shit. <laughs> fuck this shit. Oh, good idea, Percy. Why not hop into this convenient located submarine for a getaway? It's sure to be a smooth ride. I'm sure it'll definitely won't be populated with spirits of a bunch of savage wage slave cannibals. That's what it is. Each minute we spend in this nightmare is worse than the one before. I'm afraid that if we don't get out of here soon, we'll be stuck here forever just like them. And I mean forever. Let's end this. I have to return. You have knowledge for me. I read the log files. I know you killed Peter after what he did to Sophie, you bitch. I did? I did. Oh, yes, girl. That explains so much. I felt so ravenous. Always devouring, but never full. Eating away all the emptiness inside of myself, but each bite only makes me more hungry. That's why he's like an empty shell of himself, because, you know, he's a... Uh, what's my call it? Yeah. The other ghost that is unless the other ghost is a spirit she called because he looks much more powerful than the other one although she is a bit on the naked side and uh, what do you think of my story do i horrify you frighten you or do you feel pity your sick broke a taboo you ma he made you do it you shouldn't have been here in the first place yoseth yoseth did wrong but that does not excuse your own actions you deserved one another i wish you'd both have stayed dead <laughs> Oh, that's funny. Um, I don't know. What what's my take on this? What's my take? And I wonder if this uh, because I bet you if I say the last one, we're probably gonna be fighting. I, th I think this is a critical junction where it actually doesn't matter what I say. But uh, he didn't make her do it. He. She didn't question it. Uh, he should. You shouldn't have been here in the first place. You have to did wrong, but that does not excuse your own actions. I think that's the most balanced uh, a response. I'm gonna go with that one. Peter's actions explain my own, even if they do not justify them. Just as my actions will explain yours. I remember. Combat. I remember. Neutral turn. I remember another. Oh, it's for over. This vessel, it is our relic. It is our coffin. It is our weapon. We shall destroy this vessel and all within it. Then we may find peace. So may it be. And we gotta fight. Okay, so who's the real? The real, the spirit of Sophie is probably the one that's gonna be the dangerous one. Because I think that's the spirit of wind. There were really only three people on this freaking vessel. What a joke. How many enemies do I see? I have three. I'd like to get the bot involved. Early. So that way he can sort of... Well, that's the thing. These mobs are never blocked. So he can try to block her in. Missed her, uh, right? But this is going to be... Okay. This is going to be very interesting. Why does she have such... I don't get... The... Hold on. Where is everybody? Where is he at? Oh, he's over here. It's quite okay. Yeah, it's such a narrow corridor. It's difficult to see... Blank. 
And it's just difficult to see how this is going to hit and whether or not it's going to hit somebody that I don't want it to hit. He's right there. Um, that's El Duce, okay? That's my buddy. And this is where she's at. <coughs> she's only got one movement. Yeah, I'm coughing quite a bit. Um, and my throat is dry. Let me just get the fuck out of dodge. There we go. Okay. And let's cast a spell. On her. Do you have any water left? Ah. Sounds like I have ice. Hmm. Yeah, I put the size in here at 11, 11 a.m. this morning. So it's now this size has been in this container for well over 12 hours and it's still cold. Yeah, it's kind of neat. All right, so he's flank, he's flank. <coughs> yeah, let's buff up. I mean, I didn't do it before and it cost me. And where is El Duch? And he's sort of I want him to move. This is this close quarter fighting. It's for the birds. But I would like him to block her, her this ability to move in here. Can you blow her away? This is this is true. Ah, that's nice. Yeah, okay, so she can shoot. Is she gonna hit him though? That's what I'm worried about. You shoot this girl in the head. Seventy-four, ninety-nine, seventy-four, ninety-nine. Alright, let's punch her. There we go. Oh, she's running away. The spirit is moving away too. Yeah, you see how they're. It's funny. It's, oh, is they? That's weird. They're freaking. They're. Uh, that's weird. Freaking chair got stuck. How long has it been like that? Not dicked up all night. Yeah, she ran over here, ran out of her action points. He didn't even get hit. He didn't even wound it. He was trying to get in here really badly. I'm not getting this. The rats behaved this way too when I got him first, so. God, I hope it's not a bug. I hate bug. Let's take her out. <laughs> Sounds like a dude. Yeah, she's done. Okay. What is he gonna do? Let's put armor on this dude right here. Make sure he's doing well and he's healthy. I'm gonna leave him for last. Or am I? No. Let's just take a pot shot at this guy. Nice. Thank you, Peter. What are you thinking, Peter? That shotgun. No, let's just see if we can make it from here. Robot. 
the, no, it's her. Yeah, my concern again is that the they're gonna get yeah, but that's all right. Robot, put a, put a couple of shots in her. Oh, he made it nice. Let's uh, shoot this guy too. Oh, here comes the attack. Oh. Oh, he missed. Neutral turn. I don't know about neutral. More like enemy turn. Is there a neutral out there somewhere? Because if there is, I have not seen him. <sighs> He's immune to something. Oh, like I think it's the, her AP attack. Her, you know, action point uh, reduction attack. He's too far. Let's move him out of the way. See if we can put a couple of shots in her. At least one shot. Yeah, he's got a reload. Yeah, so a reload. Now, what I could have done instead of reloading is switch a machete and go out there, but I think what I. That's what she's for. The adept is really adept at kicking ass, and that's what I wanted to do. Karma! That's it, right? No more spirits! All right, then. Great. Let's get this engine repaired. I thought there was something over here. Oh, let's go upstairs. I think uh, there was some wiring that I need to get to. There was a neutral entity in here, I thought, too, but... It's a weird bug where you can't click on shit unless you move, like, a certain distance. It bugs the shit out of me. Ah, Bokorin, repair engine! Looks to see, <laughs> to see how funny that is. What is this? I didn't even notice it was like a face right here. My ghost is watching. See, the bodies are gone. Fucking haunted chef. Repair engine done. Sweet. I declare the submarine functional once more. I'll pilot us north to Emeryville. We can pop up near the marina there and lose ourselves in Ork Town before the Shawazi sport us. Sport, spot us. Sport us. So sporty. Sit back and enjoy the ride, chummer. Uh, well, there's nothing to check out. Is there anything to check out anywhere? There's nothing else to check out. So I saw all of the sub. I've been all over the sub. Even after killing them, they didn't drop anything. Let's check out the rest of the sub. Do I have to come back and talk to her? All right, we got the time. Okay, so there's nothing. We're done. Oh no, there it is. What is that? Oh, you have to go. You have to touch the engine to to go. Okay, I see. Well, let's do a quick look around. I, I do want to see if I missed anything or if anything appeared afterwards after our little fight. But it is a bit brighter. Oh, there doesn't seem to be anything I miss. Let's go back upstairs. Well, I guess the credit, the credits, there's no way I would have missed those. This, this, this adventure doesn't give you that kind of flexibility. <clears throat> And the sub isn't even that freaking big. That's kind of nice. You just trigger the objective again and again. That's kind of economical. Um, I gotta put economical uh, scripting or programming. Percy, uh, Percy pilots the submarine north along the shore while you monitor sonar for pursuit. Sonar for pursuit. A dragnet of large vessels have started swooping the area. You find an opening through the line, and Percy makes her landfall along the Emerville Marina. <clears throat> Excuse me. After slaving, after slaving the vessel's command module to her rig, she directs the sub back to the seafloor while you locate a conveniently unattended delivery truck. Doing you, Percy, and three hundred pounds of frozen sore burgers on their way to the freeway, headed back home.
All right, so I'm going to stop here uh, for a moment. Where am I? Yeah, I'm at like a, an hour at 30. Um, get some water because I'm feeling a bit uh, thirsty, and uh, we'll be back.
All right, I'm back. Sort of. Mm. I'm still hot. It's so hot. It's like 90 degrees in here, and I'm gonna sell the ice cream. Hmm. <clears throat> Let's get back to the action. I'm still gonna eat my ice cream though. Looks sick music finally. Hmm. So this is my HQ. <clears throat> This poor house. <laughs> the dwarf is right here. I'll talk to her real quick. He's a cutie. He looks like a real person. That's what I like about her. Hmm. Oh, you're just buying pay data. I certainly am. More accurately, I'll broker for tools for you. I'm supposed to be able to make their way through be your host, and it's hella easy. Hella. Hella easy to find buyers for any sort of confidential data you might have picked up from the Matrix. I haven't picked up shit from the Matrix. Oh, they don't know we charge our brokerage fee, but hey, we're practically family, right? Oh, yeah, we're family, right? Any cash you earn is going to help keep you in way Safe and sound. Anyways, is that just a hypothetical question, or do you have some data that uh, you'd like to sell? Nothing at the moment. I haven't found anything. I haven't even been to Matrix yet. Okay, let me know if you find anything interesting later on. Okay, so I'm done talking here. I think I've asked her, like, you, like, we're going to do this. She goes on talking about how fulfilling it is. Uh, it makes a few complete one hours. <laughs> this is me twisting myself around. So the art style in this game is nice. I do like the sort of uh, the huddle. I mean, it's a little moving the stream is not too dark on that side. OBS is looking a little dark, but it could be my monitor. Me. Okay, yeah, so this is HQ. I almost want to kind of <laughs> in the stream right here. Is uh, yeah, let's just say goodbye. Because usually what happens at this point is that we'll talk, there's a lot of uh, character development at this point uh, that takes place. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, just a lot of talking. I, mean, I definitely have to talk to Percy. This place, uh, a little messy on this side. Let's see. Yeah, I gotta talk to Percy. Got candles and stuff. Well, I don't know why they're burning candles. They got lamps. A lamp lit right here. Oh, that's right. This is like a squad or something. I forget exactly where they're at. With all the kind of boxes and jugs, and there's a drain in the middle. Oh, this wasn't quite the place where people lived before. Like a butcher, what does she have to say? Yeah, what's up, boss? Oh, hey, boss. You're not originally from here, are you? Uh, what took you off? We were, you were told us that the, on the ship. Uh, you're at the laid back as folks here. The archers are hybrid, surprise. That right? <laughs> Should I think this is a compliment? Never did like how Bearians always act like everything's gonna turn out great no matter what. Uh, I came here from Central Valley. Grew up near Sacramento. Got the hell out of there a few years back. Just before the two of us bumped into each other, actually. And yourself? You're, so, you're supposed to be friends, by the way. Where do you hail from? Somewhat friends. Acquaintances, I would say more. Like, we've done jobs together. Yeah, you see, so this is where you can do, like, a whole family. You can build your character up to a certain extent. Um... 
<laughs> None of your business. I come from far away. So in Asia, uh, Europe. Come on, no Latin America? What's wrong with you? His name is Estrella. Where do you think he's from? But she could be from Spain. Let's do it. Oh, cool. I haven't met too many folks from that far away. Did you come over here on a plane or did you take a sailboat? Never mind. You're making me jealous. I'd love to travel for what, that far one day. That far. How do you like it here anyways? Ooh, oh, that's right. I can start flirting with, can flirt with anybody. Uh, let me let's go for the flirts immediately. Yeah, this the, this creator definitely made a lot of flirts. You can have like romantic. I think you can have romantic relationships. We'll see where it goes because I haven't finished this one or the other one that this uh this author created. Would like it more if I had someone here to pass the time with. But where can I find an attractive work woman to give me the time of day? <laughs> That's such an obvious one. I like it a lot. The reviews are beautiful and talented. I've got the we got the theater, mega corpse, and gangs. What's not to like? I'll go with that one. Ah, that's for sure. No facing obstacles like that can that can bring out the best in people. Life wouldn't be boring if it was too easy, you know? Yeah, but that's like super hard. Uh myself, I've had a bit of adjustment since moving out here. It's way more crowded than in, than I'm used to. I don't like it that much. What's the point of uh souping up a hot rod rig that can reach three hundred clicks? But the roads are so congested, you can't run. You can just run. Oh, so congested, you just run into whoever's in front of you. Yeah, well, she's got a point. Fortunately, I installed the cow catcher on old Bessie, and now people know when they uh, know to get the hell out of my way when they see me coming. A cow cat. Hmm. I'm trying to get the mental image of that, but it's not clicking. I used to hate geography around here too. Too many mountains and water, way too close to each other. Back in the valley, I could build up a nice head of steam. Just blast it at full power for hours and hours. Out of here, you need to always watch where you're going. But when I figured, hey. But then I figured, hey. Make your problem into an opportunity, you know? So I learned how to make amphibious vehicles and add... Uh, VTOL to my four wheelers and now well Diablo or the Bay ain't gonna stop me when I need a quick getaway Diablo or the Diablo the Diablo Mountains is what you're talking about Plus orcs are pretty friendly to orcs Out here That's a nice change of base from Valley Nobody has much patience for humanists or the native Californians, especially not here in Auckland So yeah, very cool uh, was that it? I bought the Alameda job. I wanted to talk to you about what went down last time. She probably cuts you off. Look, history is fascinating and all, but you can just always focus on what's in the past. You can't always focus on what's the past, like driving a car for you. Like, like driving a car, yeah? You gotta keep your eye on the windshield in front of you and not the rear view mirror. Future is where action's at. If it's ever important, we can talk about it. I don't see how relevant, how how it's relevant right now, though. So let's just smile and drop it. Okay, cool, good talk, boss. Uh, goodbye. Yeah, so you can say things that will end your, well, you can in the original campaign, but you can say things that will end your line of inquiry. When you're talking to an NPC, you can definitely say the wrong thing that will shut them down. But it'll only do it for a little while, usually like a day. He's so ponderous. Look at her. Don't talk. Rafik smiles is your approach. Hey, partner. Good to see you on your feet. How exactly did you and Cora meet? You know what? She already asked her that. So I already asked her in the last one. So I'm going to do that all over again. So what I can do here is pick up supplies. I think I need... I need some... Do I have it on one? So we'll set us up with technology. Medical supplies. Oh, look at this. I got some. Oh, that's right. I picked up the new one. The credit stick. The credit stick. Red stick. Hey. I use both. I use two. Hold on. I wanted more. Why is it. Let's do that. Yeah, this is fine. Because I clicked confirm. That's what I want. Um, 
for a new policy auto weapon outfits street monk secure tech gardener secure tech gardener cavalier will win silver follow our protection let's pick these up is she hold on is she wearing these already no she's wearing like this outfit right here Let's preview the look. Oh, hold on. Oh, that's right. That's right. I mean. <laughs> and that's right. You don't wear any shoes. I mean, where are shoes? But shoes are for punks. I'm here to just uh, kick ass. She level them. Let me stop this here. Let me stop. Yeah, shopping in this is what it is. She's like in a terminal, like a little laptop. And go, there's another thing. What is it? This is our stash. What's in here? Yeah, okay, so this is our stash. Okay, so I thought there was somewhere else. I thought there was somewhere else I could go. No, this is okay, well, fuck it. Yeah, I thought there was further shipping or shopping I could do. Okay, so I got auto technology. What technology? Oh, okay, yeah. See, I don't need stuff. Drones. Now I have the money for new drones. Outfit, ballistic, uh, cargo carrier. Okay, so this is for like a decker. Yeah, yeah, baby. And then we have do several stats. Yeah, there's no, you can't really have cyberware installed in you. <laughs> Let's see. Let's check out the magical equipment. See, this could go to him. Point apart, little protection. Not for the late magic, but still good. No, what, are you, what does it do? It gives you armor. Get that one. But this is the one that I want to give to Rafiq because. Target. Uh, because I think he'd look uh... oh I cleared all my shit out that's not what I wanted to do there we go uh, yeah let's confirm it because then he can just put that on sign off and get it I think I can have him wear it from here oh you see in this, no, this number right here is the karma so you can use this karma to Shit, he won't put it on unless we go to um we go on a mission. Let's put this down. But that's it, I don't think I'm gonna spend any more money. Well maybe I should get some more medical supplies. Never know. No, I got plenty. Yeah, medical supplies I got. Let's look at the uh, weapons again. Yeah, for me, or for my dude. This is the, oh, that's me. Those are, the, those are the spells that I need, but I'm not, I haven't trained that far into it, so. What's this called? There's more to do next, too. So I have to train them. But yeah, when you come back here, things kind of really slow down to a crawl. So now they get to choose, um, they, I get to choose another thing that they can go into another, well, I think he, he didn't gain a level. Somebody did, not him. She did. That's right. I don't know why the picture is not changing, but it's her. I don't know why. Yeah. This gain level too, but he hasn't gained shit. Okay, rigor, gain, ability, neural, net, neural network. Uh, Percy slaves her embedded circuitry into her drone's processing units, effectively transferring 
for a P to a drone. Oh no. Demolisher implant cyberware laser designator. Percy gains an eye implant, which makes it shows an enemy easier to hit. Yeah, I don't wanna I wanna I want her to be a rigger, so we'll we'll stick with rigger stuff. Are you sure you want to go through selections? Is that should have your mind? Go for it. Okay, so once that's done, you'll notice that the little you only get this when you're in a place where you can train them anyways, and that'll be gone. Sometimes, depending on which campaign you're in, you can actually sleep in some places, but that's the exit. This is your stash. And what is my mission? I gotta recruit a Decker and a Pyro. Yes, I do. So before I do that, do I want to use my Karma? Oof. And I thought the music was playing like a second ago, and they just kind of just died when I went to doctor. So this is going to pop up a new window where I can spend points. Nine is not a ton of points, um, but as an adept, my main focus, I, you got to pick a focus and just kind of stay with it. Um, <clears throat> it's definitely not going to be melee weapons, um, and it's not going to be throwing a lot either. See, this is five, that would leave me with four, which I guess I could put down here. So everything that I do would be and strength only. I don't know if that's a bad idea or not. Everything's up to five, except willpower, which if I wanted to, and, and I don't need it beyond five, to be honest with you. Um, what I need to get up is these, these particular abilities right here. And this one right here, magic resistance, and so for this, they're useful. But let's do what works best, and I think strength is what works. And then I can do roundhouse kick, which would be useful. There we go. And I do want to spend a little bit on quickness and dodge, but this is the thing is that you end up having to put too much money into these, and in the end, it's not really worth it. So either you do that, or you just spend money on getting your body up, so that way you can increase your, uh, you know, your hip. All right, so let's confirm it. Yeah, I'm going to stay that way, and I'm good to go. Save. Yes. To look, <coughs> to look for the decker or to look for <coughs> the phoenix. <coughs> I don't know what. After eating that popcorn, man, it's like stuck in the back of my throat or something. Oh, yes. It still feels so much back there. All right, well, let's see. Let's get a let's get a Decker. If we had a Decker, if we would have had a Decker. When we went to get her, I think this whole thing would have been easier. I would love the gauntlet to look for the, look for the Decker, for a Decker. Well, we'll see how far we get on that one. Now you can add him, definitely, and I get her. And I think that's all you can add. You can only take three people. This is slot is going to be taken by the guy you're looking for. I'm ready to return to the gauntlet. Before we go into the gauntlet, it'll give me an opportunity to pick some med kits, so I'll load up then and I'll also switch uh, my buddy's outfit. Yeah. The gauntlet can take a hit. I'm sorry, the gauntlet can hit you like a mauled fist. But it isn't as solid as one might think. From week to week, the scene on the ground changes as gangs gain and lose territory. Saito mounts attacks and pulls back under heavy losses, and patchwork of various opposition gangs waxes and wanes in influence. The only constant is danger, but the source and nature of that danger is always shifting. 
following leads for the elusive Sable, your attention is drawn to the Oak Orkland Raider. I spent that group from the radical metahuman people army, people's army. If your Deku can be found anywhere in the sprawl, this is a good place as any to start looking. So this, uh, well, you see, he's he's already. Hold on, this is me, and I got plenty of stuff. How did I get rid of me? Yeah, I don't get why I have a grenade, but I'll take it. See, I should be able to give him this outfit. And he should be able to wear it. Yeah, this is long, so when we come back from the mission, what he's going to do is he's going to stop wearing it. I should have gotten a better gun. So he's got his little gun there. He's got no, no range, the... Uh, Weapon. Let's give him a shit. We may have to take that back. We don't know where he's all about. Where's he's got a kit? So he's got a kit to repair his drone. All right, let's see what's up. Check these guys out. Check his outfit out. <laughs> That's hilarious. Let's check him out. I gotta, I gotta see this. Oh, look at that. Looking like a badass mage. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it isn't, it isn't perfect. Gotta remember, this is like a Kickstarter game. They got everything else right. Uh, they don't have to look like perfect 3D models close up. Because you're never really close up to them. Just, you know, just close enough when they look alright. I mean, close enough when you're, when you have to pull back and looking for this direction. Oh, what's going on here? Raider, look out, dead man walking. I saw you go down, woman. Nobody could get up from that. You must be a ghost. He ain't only a ghost. He was all shot up, and this fool called the medics to revive me. Probably thought I was all grateful and shit. Well, I ain't. He killed Joshua. And the rest of our posse besides me. See me the score. Oh, that's right. She gets blown up to bits. And, uh... They end up, uh... Yeah, she ends up getting blown up to bits. And the she... They, he ends up... She ends up healing and... Then they go on the lamb. There's something they get. They get paid for something when she gets blown up. Man, so I don't have any like really good uh, checks. If you need a fight, I'll give you one. There's two. There's got to be at least three people here. Um, we'll probably be alright in a fight. Let's talk this over, man. No talking. It's time to kill. Three people. Yeah, three enemies. About four enemies. Oh, they're packing. They're packing heat. Okay, so this guy, the attack dog's enemy, but I guess what do we got? Right on now. We got a... We got a totem, though. Raider heavy. Alright, dude. Do your thing. I actually would like him to take cover, but I think I will have him take cover. Let me see if we can find any. He's got some here. It's about the closest and best he can, I think, he'll find. Or he'll be able to find. He can hide right there. But no, I think I want to hide right here. Or not hide, but move. Now the... The line of sight he should have. Oh, she missed, damn it. 
They all need to take cover. They, they all should take cover, but she's in the depth. She's gonna have to stay out in the open, but yeah, they should all take cover. At least some cover, any cover. Oh, that work. Press the devotes her attention to her drone, increasing his AP by one. She can only boost the drone once per round. Well, I need to, I can't use my, I need to put him in control mode first and that will take up one AP right there. And now it's his turn. And the thing with the drone is that it doesn't, uh, it could be destroyed and it definitely takes damage, but I can't see what this guy's wearing. Oh, well, I'm not wearing, but uh, what am I thinking here? What uh, what weapon he has? Let's move forward and then shoot the guy that's as the best. Uh, it's actually the better one. There we go. Nice. At least he hit a grenade. Oh damn it! Oh shit! Oh shit! Shotgun. Oh, that hurt. He needs to, he needs to do something. Can he see her? Oh, he's got no line of sight. He's got no line of sight. He can't cast that spell anyways. Let's see who could he hit? That's some pretty yeah, that's right there. Can I have any grenades? No, he doesn't. Oh nice. Shoot him. Oh he missed. Oh he missed twice. She doesn't have much she can do here, but what she can do is boost her, boost her drones, and the drone should not have an IP, and he should be able to shoot again. Oh, you motherfucker! How is he messing them? Now, see, she's gonna get to use the roundhouse kick right away. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it only hit. Oh, it takes a little more AP. Nice. Oh, that's all right. C and E hits. Ouch. Taking cover. Ouch. I am so gonna kill that guy. The music is so calm. And they're heavy cover, huh? Let's have her expend her ability so it can he can get one more AP. I'm gonna just kick him. She only has one AP. What's going on there? Yeah, I definitely want him going down first. Well, I can't see this dude back there very well. But I also cannot flank him. I guess I could, but that would take too, too freaking long. Let's do the drone first, see what he can do. He can definitely have fun. Well, he also can't hit him, apparently. God damn it. Just gonna put Overwatch down. Oh, thank God. Ouch. I 
I'm definitely gonna punch you, dude, really hard. There you go. Look at that. That's my. Uh, let's see that. Sixty-one there, nice. Just to I better. Oh, he's down. Okay. Let's. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go have her give her her power to a drone. Then use the drone to cause some havoc. He's 55. Hey dude. Oh, nice. Here comes the dog. Oh, he's not gonna get to me in time to bite me. I don't think at least. But I am gonna be able to put a few bullets in him. Let's see. Can she shoot him using the shotgun? He's probably gonna hit him though. Yeah, let's do it on the let's bring the drone over. I think that'll be the best bet. Then we're gonna have the drone come to here. Oh, no. what is she moving there for? Come on, drone, working. Oh, the drone can move even less than she can. Let's see if you can finally hit something. Ah, finally. Well, I mean, the only thing that, the thing that annoys me about the, the combat for the Motoro, though, because in the game doesn't give you metered experience, you don't get any kind of quantifiable experience. Um, but the thing that bothers me is they don't drop anything. Oh, there's nothing down there. There's no way to get over here. Yeah, this is the edge of the map. So let's go the other way to see if I can find something of interest. Probably gonna find more gangers. Oh, hold on, boss. My RCC is acting up again. <laughs> is there something I can hit to make it better? Chrissy pulls out her rear control console, running as she scans the readout for the flipping pen by flipping switch. Shit, should have taken care of this back at the base. Never had the damn soldering iron when I need one. Oh, riggers. I just need to reboot it. Need to pull the old turn it off and turn it back on trick, but that's the best I can do in the field repair. Or field repair. She pisses herself for the controls. Long time password. <laughs> I'm going to miss my shows if you don't hurry it up. What? She seems peeved the more with herself than you. Uh, sorry, boss. It's just that I need to depress the reset switch while holding both override buttons and it's kind of hard to do with just two thumbs uh, I can hold the box while you do your thing here let me get that button oh, let me see. there we go okay sure let's see what happens you lend a hand a few seconds later a, ch a chiming noise in the case that the reboot was successful wow that was uh, a lot faster than usual I appreciate it she's gonna fall in love I've been running, I've been running solo for so long. I'm used to doing everything myself. Got pretty decent at it too, but I guess running with a team has some advantages. I may need to start. I may need to start on learning some of those old habits. I never want to start hitting on her. Uh, it's great that you can take care of stuff on your own. Having help is just a bonus. We're all here to support each other. Don't let your pride slow us down. <laughs> Maybe you should let someone else handle the tech from now on. Ooh, that's a hard one. I think uh, we uh, I think we each do a lot better if we spend more time together. Just give the word any time you need any of your buttons pressed. Oh my god, that's a good one. That's, I gotta use it. Ooh, ha! Perfectly well pressing my own buttons, man. 
Of course, you will want to demonstrate your technique. I might be interested in that. Said, oh, you're down. Okay, this thing's finally ready to do it again. Don't worry. I'll patch it up properly next chance I get. Now let's get moving. So these are these. In the other games and the other campaigns, the official ones from Hairbrain, they did stuff like this too. They would like stop the action and kind of have interaction with the characters. And I think it's kind of nice. It's um, uh, it builds a bit of story. So you get to you're fleshing out the characters to a certain extent. You know, she's you know wild and crazy and kind of scatterbrained and you know kind of like me always late not getting stuff done and kind of attractive it wasn't for the teeth then rafik he's just you know he's just hoping for menage a another female in the mix he'd be down for that too then he can have one of each race he's a horny little fuck a cop what's up cop Hey, Blackstar, I haven't seen you around these parts lately. I'm recovering from an injury. <laughs> Your insight was never very good. I've been busy. Look, I know you. I know you're especially just getting shot at, but I was wondering, you can be up for some actual police work. Oh, what does he want me to do? What does he want me to do? I'm investigating an outbreak of murders on this block. First Sammy shot pants. First Sammy shot. <laughs> First. Semi short pants got iced. Now Oscar the ouch. It's one thing for addicts and gangsters to show up as corpses, but business folks are less, are much less common. I figure is it has to be either the mutants, the metahuman people's army, or the orc land raider. They've been fighting over the corners the last couple of weeks, and it's inevitable that people would get caught in the crossfire. But I'll need some harder evidence to close the case. Why do you care? And it leads. I'll see what I can do. You're on your own. And it leads. Why are there a few witnesses nearby that couldn't get that I couldn't get a dock, but you might have better luck. Other than that, not really. The body's still festering in the southwest if you want to check it out. Why do you care? Ah. Oscar was parts distributor for an electronics component company owned by Renraku. Ren Renraku. He's the smallest fry there is, but still part of the supply chain, so the the cops are taking notice. If I can show them where where, where to bring down the hammer, there might be a nice bonus for me. And it for me. And that all your favor. I'll see what I can do. I appreciate it, Black Star. Good luck. Hmm. Examine corpse. He said, I thought he said the southwest. Southwest would be down here. Right? Over this way. No, it's over there. So you would have had to go down here anyways to investigate and run into these puzzles and fought them off. That's the body I passed by earlier. Body starting to grow rank. He's having cause of death. Look again, consider the message sent by the wounds. Biotech closely examine the wounds. A biotech would be. If, I think biotech is when you're good at. But do you have implants to that point? I don't know. Range combat 4. Analyze the blood splatter pattern. I don't have any of those. Uh, I have to examine examine the cause of death. Oscar was shot a lot. You got one wound in the thigh, one in the chest, and three in the head. You make it this Rafik. Grounds of concentration. We've seen plenty of deaths out in the streets. This one seems different somehow. It doesn't look like the handiwork of gangs we run into around here. Some new players might be moving in. Maybe there's some new recruits. You could ask the locals if they've seen anything unusual lately. And that's all I can do. Alright. That's the end of the street, yeah. I don't think I can talk to it. Right, right. Can't even go that far. Yeah, the stuff's right here. This is as far as I can go. What is this back here? Nuyen? 
Can I go back there? That wouldn't pick up something. Can... Oh, who the hell is that? Oh, what is that? They lured me out there with Nuyen, man. That's not right. Shit, I forgot about her health. Oh, did I just move her back for no reason? Oh, this is MPA. Ah, oh, goddamn MPA. These guys are all orcs and trolls. I can't reach him now. I can't even take cover now. I'm seriously screwed. I can't even take cover. Let's just go. Let's just go over here. Yeah, okay. Let's take. Let's just take. Let's bring them out to the fight instead of. Uh, you know, instead of us chasing them. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna come in close. The closer works for me. Have, us being all spread out and them having all the cover. I these guys look horrible. Doesn't work for me. But this this works much better. It forces them to come after me. Let's uh Yeah. Yeah, let's do this. Percy, let's move back a little bit. Okay, that's fine. See, they all still have kind of good line of sight on them. Let's have him armor her up. Oh, he can't see her. That's right. Okay, fine. So she's around the corner. She needs to be right where he's at, more or less. I'm going to move him over here. Yeah, I wonder if this is going to work. And then she needs to move right over here. I'd actually like to punch him once at least. There we go. That's useful. Let's have her activate her toy. That way he can go right here. A pot shot. Oh, he doesn't have line of sight. Shit. How does he not have line of sight? And he also can't. Oh, he can't. He can't stop. Oh, that's too bad. She can't move either. So there's nothing much she can do. I'm gonna have to see if I can cover. No, he's not gonna be able to do shit. He he doesn't have he doesn't have Overwatch. Shit. Let's move him out a little bit. Alright, let's see what happens. Oh great. Oh that's also great. Oh awesome. Yeah, uh, I think she's about to croak. Oh, maybe not. I'm 
see what he can do. You got nine HP out of that, but that's about it. Oh, that healer. She can give her a point. I'm gonna go ahead and give her a point to this little old bastard right here. Oh, no line of sight. Well, that sucks. That really sucks. Also, she can't. She could go into Overwatch, but she's gonna be shooting her friend if she does that. So. No, you're gonna blast a shotgun blast right into her face. Now, what I want the robot to do is flank this guy and then shoot him. There we go. And she, this one, let me actually, yeah, let me put a heal on you there. <laughs> nice. Oh, he's taking damage every time. Ooh. Even with the flank, he's still doing well. So we take two... Yeah, let's go ahead and stop right there on that one. Let's have him move around the corner here. It should be fine, right? <clears throat> Excuse me. I still don't have line of sight. Well, if he fucking moves, that. Is there a line of sight on anybody? No. Okay, so in case they move, well, I can just put them on Overwatch. Ah. Uh. I'm gonna send her out there to the punch stuff pretty quickly, pretty soon here, but I should have spelled her up a little bit more. Nice, one down, two, two, one down, two left. Well, three left, but, you know, close. Yeah, she can't make it that far, so what I'm hoping is that they'll try to make it over here. They'll try to come over here, so we will... And we will end it right now. Oh, hold on. Yeah, she can't throw an eye from that distance. If they come around, they're getting stabbed. That's what I'm saying. Stop this mover just in case they move down. Oh, he gained all his AP. Ouch. Down yet? Let's get him out of dodge. How long does this last? Oh, it lasts until combat ends, right? Maybe she's not buffed then. But I buffed her. What is this? Yeah, let's see if they come through. They should. At least that elemental will. Oh, hold on. With her. Yeah, that's right. Elemental will do. Yeah, 
let them get close. I'm not gonna come out in the open. What does he have here? Yeah, I'm just gonna do Overwatch until they, they come through. We're gonna hide. See if we can bring him to our territory instead of fight, you know, fight our own fight instead of having to fight. Let's have this guy. Can he self repair? Well, she has to repair him, that's right. He can self repair somewhat. But he can't, uh, I'm gonna unplug it. She's still like an Overwatch. That's the best thing. See that? See that? They may lose control of this guy. Yeah, you see, they lost control. So now they're fighting. They're on elemental. The winning them out would worked out perfectly. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Wow, he's not fucking around. Oh, he's gonna come back and beat you up. So, so, so I don't, I don't want to come out for this freaking fiasco here. I let the fight. I'm gonna continue throwing blades at this guy. Nice. Shit, I did not know she was so dangerous with a blade. Yeah, I'm gonna continue to watching, overwatching. Let's see, because he might survive that whole thing, or he might just be stupid enough to come this way. Oh, okay. He he dispelled them. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna do the same thing. Shit, I'm having too much fun doing this. He's seriously not gonna move. Okay, fine. Let's see if I can take an aim shot on him. She's the problem right there. Let me let me see if I can jack into the The bot here. Well, he needs to go too. She can use one of her abilities to make him go farther. And use them like I usually do. It's just like they sneak in, do point blank, boom, is done. Because they have pretty decent movement. And now we can talk to the cop again. Nah, I'll keep it posted. I'm just killing these motherfuckers right here. By the way, I'm gonna get that new in right now. So, uh... Be actually gonna get that. Ooh, 497. I don't think there's anything much back here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no, 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 come back. All right, so we got to open a gate to go through there. Oh, hold on. The person I can speak with right here. Who has uh, a moha, a green moha, nice. Fuck my light. My light. My light that's touching my flesh. Investigate a murder. I'm so reminded of you. Hope you don't investigate every murder that occurs in Oakland. You never have time for anything else. Oh, oh I'm so funny. Do you think, uh, do you know who killed uh, Oscar the Ouch? 
Don't know the name. I may know something about recent killings here, but I'm going to start watching or share that information with you. Because I'm going to punch you. Uh, let me see. 300 yen. Two yen. You should perform your civic duty. <laughs> um, 300 yen. That's funny. I've always felt exactly the same way. The perp is an asshat named Claude Bullion. He rolled into town a few days ago, pulling a, pulling a trail of native Californian human supremacists behind him. Native Californian. He had to work pretty quickly, striking down the various orcs and, near, and trolls nearby. I'm not sure yet what their play is. They don't have their numbers to hold any territory in Oakland, but they're definitely after something here. Now, if you excuse me, I'm going to go beat off. All right, well, you, you enjoy yourself, sir. Have a good time. I'll see you later. You know, don't, don't, don't get a rash or anything. Okay. <laughs> I'm just talking to you. All right, um, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wrap it up right here. Let me save it. But go quick and save now. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I know I'm wrapping up a little early, but that was the whole intention to begin with. To wrap up early today. Well, it was originally. I want to do something different, and I don't really care. I don't care if it costs me views or not at this point. I also want to finish Darksiders. Shit, I haven't done that in a while. Um, the sinless are free. And that's what we are. We are sinless now. Or, or are we? I don't know. Okay, yeah, so I'm going to go and wrap it up here. On, um, yeah, guys, I'm, I'm tired. I'm fading out already, so I got to go to bed. I want to thank you all for coming by. I appreciate you uh, watching, enjoying the show, and um, lurking, whatever. Uh, it was a slow night. It is something a little different, but, you know, Variety Gaming is what I started doing, and I started, I've been playing Neverwinter for six months, so I want to kind of uh, mix it up a little bit. All right, so we'll do this again tomorrow. I'll, I'll try to get the, the time scheduling thing right, but it's still a work in progress. Um so yeah, thank you for coming by. If you like, like. If you want to follow, follow. If you want to sub in YouTube, you can. You can't sub to me in Twitch because I'm not in that stage yet. But in YouTube, you can. And um, yeah, that's it. Have a good night and a better tomorrow. Peace. Yeah. Woo!